So the other day I was thinking what would happen if a school shooter appeared at my school. It's kind of one of those situations like what if or this will happen. Obviously there's there is a cop at our school so he will literally either kill the guy or arrest him before the guy kills him. But he's only carrying like a taser and maybe pepper spray. And uh, before I get into this commentary, I actually want to apologize for any noise in the background. I'm not in my usual place. My internet has been down for a couple days and I've been just coming over a friend's house and just recording and stuff. So expect that for a couple, maybe another day or so until I get my internet back up. But um, most people don't have plans, right? They're just like, yeah, I wish it would have never happened in our school district or whatever, but you know, there's always those what ifs, those little possibilities that it could happen to you and your school, right? So that's what I take precautions to myself. I get one of the sharpest scissors I could find and keep that in my back pocket. So anytime something scares me, pull that out like a knife, oh, bam, right in the juggler. <clears throat> but most people, they're stupid. Most people in high school don't even have scissors. They don't even have pencils. And uh, so I'm just gonna name a couple things what I would do, what I recommend you guys probably won't do. You guys should just call 911 and get out of there as fast as possible. I'm just a little chicken. I'm not gonna run anywhere where I don't see it safe and it's open when nobody's there and I see dead bodies and blood everywhere. I'm just not gonna do that. So, um, first thing I'll probably do is, you know, go into the girls' bathroom and hide in the trash can. Some people are stupid, they hide in the stalls, they put the little, little, little feet on top of the toilets, thinking the school shooter's not gonna knock on the door, knock it down, and kill you. Like, no, you gotta hide in the trash can, because they got pretty big trash cans in high school. They don't have those little, little bitty, like, kindergarten trash cans. No, they have big trash cans you can hide in, and uh, put paper towels over you so he literally won't see you. You know, from there you can call 911, be like, hey, there are school shooters in my house, my house, my school. My bad, guys. Um, another thing you guys should probably do is Barricade yourself inside a classroom. You guys have teachers, desks, mobile labs, and all that to barricade the door. Maybe break a window so you can climb down and get away from the school shooter, but that's on your own risk. You guys don't have rope. So I have like, put down all the bags down, make it like a little mattress and just jump. You know, barricade your, you know, you, your friends, people you hate, just leave them outside. Don't quote me. But, you know, make the school shooter Work for his prize. Like, barricade the door. Literally, if it's a zombie apocalypse, you'll do the same thing, do the same thing for a school shooter. Except in a zombie apocalypse, you have each other, not just people scared for their lives because of guns pointing out their face. They can actually get away from zombies if you're not fat. You're fat, you're screwed. But, um, some other things you guys might want to do is, uh, not go to school that day. You know, you're feeling kind of iffy about it you know C's get degrees I've said this before it's not that bad you know be like mom there's gonna be a school shooter today she asked you how do you know Twitter it's the first thing that lets everybody know what happened Twitter and red reddit first thing just make up a fake lie and uh you know that's just my list you guys do whatever you guys want to do I'm just I'm just trying to survive. I know I'm not gonna take anybody to my friends. Well, I might take my friends with me. Maybe hide them in the boys' bathroom. Cause typically the girls' bathroom is always gonna be cleaner. They're always cleaner than the guys. The guys are just disgusting. Have you guys ever been to a high school bathroom? I'm pretty sure you guys have. Like who hasn't? Unless you're homeschooled, which is just weird. You have it's really, really disgusting. And uh, so <laughs> that's what I would just hide in the girls' bathroom in the trash can. It's simple as that. And it's just not that. That's it. Maybe carry the scissors in there, the gun pokes in the trash can, push the gun up, hit the guy's face, and you stab him. It's simple. And also, uh, uh, that's pretty much it, guys. You know, I want to take this last few minutes of gameplay from Rocket League, which is not Call of Duty, I might add, to Rocket League, to actually thank you guys for all the support on my videos. I know I haven't been uploading because I'm shit, but um, 
I'm doing it. I'm doing the best I can. My internet literally it's really 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 bad. So <laughs> uploading is like extremely hard for me, but uh the support you guys give me on all pretty much all my videos and we're up to like 230 something subscribers, which is really I've I'm a really bad YouTuber. Honestly, whoever whoever subscribes to me, you guys have some mental problems. I'm not saying that to be, you know, mean or funny. I'm going to take that back. But I'm just not that great as YouTube. I don't upload. I have, like, no uploading schedule. I've tried to get one. I just suck at it. I upload within two months. That's it. Boom. Your first video. There you go. Maybe a birthday present for one of you guys out there. And um, if you guys want to see more gameplay of this, Rocket League, I could probably give you guys more. I suck at the game, as you guys can tell. Look at this, how bad it is. I, just watching it makes me want to be like, no, I suck at the game. Look at that, easy shot. Oh, wait, no, that was my own goal. Zeke can't even tell the things apart. But, uh, yeah, just let me know if you guys want me to do more, you know, stories or maybe top lists or whatever, and I'll do it. I'm still working on that new series I promised you guys back when I had 70 subs, but, uh, like, forever ago. And... Uh, that series will be coming out soon. And uh, I'll see you guys in uh, probably two months again. Bye.